Graphic new details emerged during the zombie hunter trial today. Brian Patrick Miller is accused of murdering two women 30 years ago. As Morgan Lowe reports, prosecutors believe Miller planned these murders and wrote down that plan on paper. We heard about that plan in court today and a description of Brian Miller that we had not heard before, that he is highly intelligent, controlling with an angry temper. So it was my opinion that the defendant was legally sane at the time of the alleged offenses. Leslie Dana Kirby is a psychologist contracted by the court to evaluate Brian Miller. On the stand, she revealed Miller's troubled past, arrests when he was a minor for arson and criminal damage, and for stabbing a woman at the mall. While the defense argued that Miller did not remember the gruesome murders of Angela Brasso and Melanie Burnus back in the early 1990s, Dana Kirby said she found no evidence Miller had memory problems, and she pointed to a letter he wrote two years before the murders, detailing how to kidnap a teenage girl. That's the document that's been titled The Plan, and it was extremely graphic and very violent. And it was not just kidnap, but kidnap, rape, torture, terrify, kill, eat, and save some body parts. It will be up to a judge to decide Miller's fate. This is a bench trial, so there's no jury. I'm Morgan Lowe for Arizona's Family Investigates. Morgan, thank you.